Alright guys, my name is BodyKiwi and welcome back to another Fortnite challenge video. There's new challenges because Season 4 has landed. And there's lots of new challenges that come with that. The meteorite has hit, it's changed the map, changed the game so much. But there's so many new challenges in the game as well. But one of the new challenges is the search the Fortnite letters. Now this challenge was actually pretty tricky. It was actually really fun as well. I'm going to show you how to do that, the quickest method. So the first one we're going to go for is in Lonely Lodge. Now Lonely Lodge has changed a little bit. There is a mansion in Lonely Lodge now, which is a great addition to it because it was quite a rubbish area before. A lot of people thought, I've always enjoyed it, but now there's more reason to go there. Because um, the Lonely Lodge it now has this big mansion, it has lots of things in it. It's actually a secret superhero lair underneath as well, if you go on and check that. But you want to build up to it, okay? Or you can land on it, but if you fall short, you can build up to it. It's the F on the roof of the mansion. There you go, first layer. The second one we're going to go for is actually at Haunted Hills. Now this one was a nightmare. Honestly, you can't land close enough to get this thing. It's on that silly gravestone. You can't land on it. You have to build up to it. There's so many people around. It was honestly took me at least like 10 tries. But this guy's trying to get cocky. Boom! Good night, sunshine. So now we've cleared Haunted Tales. There was loads of people there, honestly. I only managed to get one of them, but I just kind of stayed hidden until they were gone because I wanted to get it. But the second O, second letter, the O is there. Now the third one we're going to go for is actually at the racetrack, that kind of maze, but don't worry about it, right? It's not like you have to do this in order. All the letters, if you go to whatever location you go to, the letters will come up in order. So if you went to this racetrack first, it would be the F that was there and not the R. The R is there for me because it is my third location. All these locations can be visited in any order, so don't worry about that. But we're going here for the R. Look at that big crater that's landed there as well. It's absolutely awesome. I love this new update. It's so cool. I'm actually going to show you this as well. They have little pieces of anti-gravity crystal, all right, in any meteor site. Where the meteors have hit, if you consume that, it will give you a boost to your jump. It's like anti-gravity moon boots. It's absolutely insane. These guys keep adding so many cool new features to the game. So basically, it's good to get that at the anti-gravity. And of course, people are going to come along and try and ruin your day. Get out of here, buddy. I'm trying to collect the Fortnite letters. So you want to get the anti-gravity anti -gravity crystals and that'll be how you jump up on top of this house to get the third layer. It's just beside the crater, honestly. It's just, there's a crater there. You can just jump up and get it. It's no problem at all. And the next one we're going to go for is in Tilted Towers. Again, an absolute nightmare of a letter to get because it's on top of the clock tower and so many people kept coming here. Again, like 10 tries to get this one. And this guy was more determined on smashing through the roof than actually hitting me. So I got an easy bludgeon from my pickaxe. But he was trying to smash for the roof, and of course if he smashes for the roof, it makes it much harder to get that layer. I don't even know if it registers after that, it might not register. Okay, on to the next layer, and the next one you can get is actually around the new, where the meteor had the, had the biggest impact, around the new Dusty Divot, where the old Dusty Depot. And this one was actually a much easier to get, it's on top of one of these uh, pylons, these metal pylons, but it's a much bigger, flatter surface, so it's much easier to land on, and that's exactly what you do, you land on top of the pylon, and you'll get your next layer. I mean, for me, it was the end. So we have Fortn. On to the next one. And this one is located at Moisty Mire. Again, Moisty Mire is a place that's had a big update, a big makeover. It's been turned into a sort of film set. It looks very different. Uh, and one of the cool features in here is they actually have a helicopter with a green screen around it, which is insane. Uh, part of a film set, obviously. But yeah, the next layer is just next to the helicopter above this little tree branch. You can build up to it. Uh, and get your next layer. There are two layers left, and these ones are really easy to get as well. One's in Pleasant Park. Um, it's in the little hut in the middle of Pleasant Park, which of course is just so easy to land at. Um, if it's a busy, it wasn't busy for me that time. There was a couple of people around, but not a lot. But I managed to land there, get my letter, no problem at all. And the very, very last one is at Greasy Grove. And of course, you can get the Pleasant Park and Greasy Grove ones in the same map, providing the storm. It is, helps you in that way. It didn't for me, so I had to jump in a new match. But we get the last one here in the playground on top of the climbing frame. Fortnite. That is all the letters. Boom! Confetti. Celebration. And we're done. So that's all the Fortnite letters. There you go. That's how you do it. Thank you so much for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed it. A comment below and let me know if this video helped you. And I will see you in the next one. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.